In 1990, the premium American Buick Skylark enters the market with a revised model lineup which features a new Skylark Coupe and Skylark Sedan. Both are keyed directly at price-conscious buyers and represent premium value in Skylark. At the heart of the lineup is a newly appointed custom coupe and custom sedan. For the sport-minded, there's a new Skylark Grand Sport Coupe, and the luxury edition sedan model continues as the top-of-the-line Skylark. All in all, the 1990 Skylarks represent a wide range of value, interior accommodation, and luxury in a stylish, compact size with a big car Buick ride. With the 1990 Skylark, we listen to our dealers and the input that they've given us over the last year, and in addition, did a lot of extensive research with our customers over the past year. We talked to people who buy cars in the compact class, which is where the Skylark competes. We also talked to current owners of the Skylark and asked them what they want on their car and what they would change on the car they're driving right now. And we learned some very interesting things from talking to the dealers and the customers. We found out that there, there are three important motivators for purchasing vehicles in the compact class and they are quality, styling, and value. Well this year in the Skylark we have a quality story to tell, we have an attractive vehicle, we have a strong warranty program, we have good fuel economy. In the 1990 Skylark the things that we have changed include things like the uh, redesigned instrument panel. The HVAC controls are now within easy reach of the driver. We redesigned the radio and we now have knobs and much simpler design. One of the other changes we made was we moved the windshield wiper controls from the dashboard to the multifunction control lever where the cruise control is. So it's right on the steering column now, much easier to access and easier to use when you're driving the car. Uh, again, all these changes that we did in redesigning the IP also had another uh, positive benefit for us and for the customer, and that is it is now opened up that whole part of the car. So when you order the 90 Skylark with the split bench seat in the front, you now get a wide open interior. So it increases the perceived roominess of the car. We also, in 1990, have a new standard feature on our custom Grand Sport and Luxury Edition models, and that's the split folding rear seat. And that is a wonderful new benefit for customers. The Skylark is seen as a car that people step up to. So that Buick Skylark nameplate carries a lot of weight in this segment of the market and has a lot of value to the customer. There are a number of refinements and product improvements in the 1990 Skylarks. Joining the list of standard equipment is a new 2000 series ETR AM FM stereo radio with its conventional knob type controls. New and standard on all Skylarks except the premium value models is a split folding rear seat with inertia lock. The power window option now includes an automatic or auto down feature for the driver. A mirror mounted reading light for both driver and front passenger is another new option. The transverse mounted 2.5 liter Tech 4 engine with electronic fuel injection and balance shaft for smooth operation is the standard power plant for the front wheel drive Skylark. There are two optional engines, the 2.3 liter Quad 4 with its dual overhead cam configuration and an output of 160 horsepower and the 3300 V6 with multi-port fuel injection which has proven to be one of the most responsive and quiet in the industry for its weight and size. Presenting the 1990 Skylark Custom Sedan with refinements and new interior appointments for added customer satisfaction and appeal. Composite tungsten halogen headlamps complement a handsome new grille with a bright perimeter molding. A standard front license plate bracket is included in the trunk. The popular Skylark custom exterior styling is accented with narrow rocker panel moldings. In 1990, both coupes and sedans share the same tail lamp configuration. For the new Grand Sport Coupe, a front air dam, an aero rocker panel molding, and specific tail lamps create a unique appearance. Shelby aluminum wheels and low profile P21560R14 Eagle GT Plus 4 black walls complete the exterior look. In 1990, all wheel and tire selections go to 14 inch except for the premium value Skylarks, 
whose wheels and tires remain at 13 inch. New 185-75R14 Blackwall radials and styled steel hubcaps with trim rings are standard on the 1990 Custom Skylarks. The optional locking wire wheel cover for Skylark Custom Coupe and Sedan is 14 inch in 1990. The new wire wheel cover option requires P185-75R14 white wall radials. This wheel and tire combination is standard on the Skylark Luxury Edition. Wire wheel covers and white wall tires complement the Luxury Edition's exterior styling with its classy grill header applique, heavy padded full vinyl roof, and two-tone paint treatment. The front seating area of the custom sedan and the luxury edition is more spacious and roomy in 1990. The reclining front bench seat is revised to accommodate the new recessed storage tray and coin holder. The fold-down center armrest continues. Door panels are trimmed in vinyl. The carryover automatic front safety belt system provides comfort and ease of entry. The Skylark instrument panel is redesigned for 1990. Analog gauges are backlit, which makes information easier to read. The radio and the heater and air conditioner controls have been repositioned to make them easily accessible. The new standard Skylark radio for 1990 is a 2000 series ETR AM FM stereo with seek and scan and clock. The unit has conventional knob controls. Cruise control and wiper washers have been relocated to the multifunction control lever. The column mounted shift for the standard three speed automatic was another customer driven change. This year, both the shifter and the tilt lever are chrome with black handles. Power steering and power brakes continue as standard equipment. The parking brake is foot operated. Another new convenience feature on all Skylarks is a turn signal warning chime to prevent turn signals from being accidentally left on for long distances. Connected to the odometer, it sounds a warning when Skylark has traveled a half mile with the turn signals on. A new interior lighting delay feature which leaves the interior lights on for a short period of time after exit, entry or until engine startup is standard on all models. A new reading light for the driver and passenger is available on the Custom Coupes and Sedans, Grand Sport and the Luxury Edition. This new feature is integrated into the inside rear view mirror as it is on the top of the line Riata. Switches are conveniently located on the mirror. In 1990, Skylark Custom, Grand Sport and Luxury Edition models have a Buick designed split folding rear seat with inertia lock as standard equipment. Buick took great care that in the down position the back would lay flat, thus making the space more usable when carrying long items such as lumber, skis, and other objects of similar dimension. Customers appreciate this flexibility in a compact car such as Skylark because it delivers the utility of a small wagon with all the creature comforts of a Buick passenger car. Skylark interior comfort and quiet ride, enhanced by the Dynaride suspension, are strong selling points during a demonstration drive. Another very accommodating feature available on all Skylark models in 1990 is the optional power windows with auto down. This feature is also available on Regal. To initiate the auto down mode, the driver must depress the power window switch for about three tenths of a second. Release the switch and the window continues to lower, thus hands are free to control steering, fish for change, or a parking stub. To partially open the window, the driver may tap the button to open the window to the desired point. The window closes in the conventional manner, with the driver depressing the switch for the full duration of the raising motion. Here is the Skylark color and trim story for 1990. A cloth split bench seat is the standard and only trim on the premium value coupe and sedan. This interior is offered in a choice of four colors. Standard on the custom coupe and sedan and available in four colors is a cloth split bench seat with manual recliners. Door panels are trimmed in vinyl. Cloth bucket seats with manual recliners and color coordinated center operating console are optional in both Skylark custom models. 
The console features a new center storage compartment. The same cloth bucket seats serve as the standard and only interior trim for the new Grand Sport Coupe. The luxury edition Skylark has a cloth split bench seat with manual recliners as the standard trim. The cloth buckets with recliner and operating center console are optional on the luxury edition. On the outside, a new gunmetal gray replaces the pewter gray in the Skylark palette of eight exterior colors. For more information on color and trim, consult the 1990 product manual. One of the major Skylark competitors in 1990, as in recent years, is the Honda Accord, which also competes in the midsize segment. 1990 competitive product information was not available at the time of production for Action Library. Comparisons reflect Buick 1990 versus competitive 1989. The Honda Accord has fewer models to choose from. Skylark offers buyers coupes and sedans, everything from premium value to the luxury edition Skylark. And this year, all but the premium value Skylarks have a brand new split folding rear seat. The split folding seat back creates a larger opening and flatter surface than the one on the Accord. In addition to the standard 2.5 liter Tech 4 engine, Skylark offers two optional engines, the 2.3 liter Quad 4 and the 3300 V6 with MFI. The Accord has no optional engine. The 1990 Skylark custom sedan rates well against the Mercury Topaz sedan GS. The Skylark has more headroom, front and rear. There is also more front leg room. The Skylark 2.5 liter Tech 4 has superior power and torque, 110 versus 98 horsepower and 135 foot-pounds of torque versus 124 for the Topaz. Skylark offers a V6 option. Topaz does not. Skylark has a Dynaride suspension. No such suspension is offered on the Mercury. Another strong contender is the 626 from Mazda. In the area of powertrains, Skylark's Tech 4 delivers more torque, 135 foot-pounds versus 130 for the 2.2-liter OHC L4 on the Mazda. Skylark offers a V6 engine. Mazda does not. In engineering, the Mazda does not have the Dynaride suspension, nor does it offer a sporty suspension, such as the Grand Touring. In 1990, Buick has gone to considerable effort to tailor the Skylark lineup to appeal to a full spectrum of buyers, from price conscious to compact buyers who want the maximum in terms of luxury and comfort. Skylark 1990, the compact size premium American motor car. <laughs>